Yo, Bose. What? Are you part of Team Shave the Beard or Save the Beard? What? Are you part of Team Shave the Beard or Save the Beard? Shave. Shave? Yeah. So you're yeah. happy with what I'm doing on December 29th? I'm going to shave my beard? Yes. All right. You do your thing over there. All right. Hey, yo, Krim. Yeah. Are you part of Shave the Beard or Team Save the Beard? <laughs> What's that answer, boy? <laughs> Well, so that's the question of the video. You're just going around asking around. Yeah, that's a pretty good question. Um, well, it's what, for it's for what I'm gonna be what, doing on December what, 29th. I just want to know what team you're on. Just what about my like beard or shaving the beard? No, I'm not on any team. Whoa. I'm in the middle. Really? Yes. So what's what? What is the middle? Like you just decide don't you want to shave the beard, but definitely trim it down. All right, but I need I need one or the other. You need it's, one or it's, the other. It's save the beard or shave the beard. But I do have freakish genetics, so this thing could grow back at any moment. Like, literally, after well, I cut it, it might grow right back. Here, here's the thing. Here's the thing, right? If you cut your hair, then save the beard. If you want to go long hair, then shave the beard. But don't, don't let it go as long. All right, so, so I'm going So I'm, I'm complicated right now. It's not, it's not, this is not a simple answer. <laughs> you're, you're trying to make it simple. It's not simple. So Krim's on the fence on, yes, on, on both worlds. I'm, can't hide the hacks. What's up, blood? Are you part of team Save the Beard or Say Shave the Beard? What? I said, are you part of the team Shave the Beard or Save the Beard? Uh, I'm part of team, well, right now I'm part of team Save the Beard, but as of, I'm thinking Christmas, I'm going to have to, I'm going to have to switch sides. So I'm going to be part of team Shave. Shave the Beard? By New Year's Day, this beard, it's not going to completely come off, but it's getting a trim. It's getting a one guard, a two guard. Something like that. It's got to be cleaned up. I've been eating my mustache for weeks now. I can't even enjoy simple pleasures in life like ranch dressing without it getting all up in my shit. So that sounds like Shave the Beard. <laughs> yeah. What's going on, YouTube? This is the Out the Beard Flamesters. As you saw from those snippets, I will be shaving my beard on December 29th. Now, I know a lot of this is going to be shocking to you all since a lot of you have come to know me with this beard. But, you know, I've been thinking that I was going to shave it at the end of the year anyways. And I wanted to figure out the best way to do it, the the biggest impact I can have uh, while doing it for a special cause. And that came uh, right away to my head was charity. And uh, the charity that I've been doing it for is called Gamers Outreach. Now, I know the, uh, the dude who runs Gamers Outreach. I've known him since a long time ago, back in the Halo 3 days when I first met him through uh, David Walshy Walsh. And, uh, you know, everything that the charity does is just fantastic to me. What they do is they build these carts, and these carts go to hospitals. Now, these carts have Xbox Ones on them, 360s, PS4s, PS3s, monitors, and they get games. And they allow for children who can't leave the hospital to play video games when, you know, their family comes visit them and stuff like that. There's going to be a link in the description below that will, if you click on the video in that link, you'll see exactly everything this uh, charity does. But I wanted to do something uh, that, you know involve video games while being able to do um, what I'm going to be doing, shaving the beard, right? I wanted to make sure that the reason I shaved my beard was that it was going to help in some sort either be toys or uh, video games for uh, children uh, for a special reason would be uh, what I do it for, and that's exactly what I'm doing it for. So my beard has been grown for a year and uh, about three months, almost, almost four months now, I'm sure, as December 18th does creep up uh, here just uh, shortly. But uh, what it is going to be is on December 29th, I will be doing one final uh, last stream with my beard. It will be a 24-hour live stream. I have now hit up all our sponsors to send us over some goodies. So that means that every hour, I will be doing a giveaway. So for you all who will be in the stream, you're going to be able to have a chance to get one of those giveaways. So that's coming to Scuffs, Astro stuff, and uh, just a lot of things that I've collected over my entire gaming career I'm going to have out there. So we're going to try to have 24 total giveaways. And if we have much more things than I think that we're going to receive, then we might even do more than 24 giveaways. But what I'll be trying to aim for all is $4,000. Now, it takes $4,000 to make a car with the whole, you know, shipping the car to where it has to go to and whatnot. And we're planning for it to be in a hospital in Chicago. Now, my other goal is to be honest with you all is that I really want to raise $10,000. Now, I know the link, which I will put in the description below, will only say $4,000. But I really want to hit $10,000 just because then I know... We could get two cards because I would like to bring one back to New Jersey, you know, because that is home for me. I would want to leave some sort of an impact uh, for my gaming career. I was, you know, I'm able to say, you know, because of the things I've done in my life, I've been able to return the favor to the state I was born in 
and uh, help with the hospital out there. So the initial goal is four thousand dollars all. The uh, secondary goal or my real goal is ten thousand dollars. So I hope you all come into the stream. You could start donating right after this video. Like I said, the link will be in the description below. I hope you all enjoyed uh, me for this uh, past year and three months with this beard. I hope you all don't change. I hope you still, you know, treat me the same. It's going to be different uh, once it is uh, shaven off the first uh, couple weeks, I'm sure. I think it's going to even take myself some time to get uh, reused to what I used to look like and all that stuff. But, you know, it is going to be 2015. I'm excited for the new change. I want to go into the, you know, the Halo season kind of the way I started it where I was clean shaven and uh, other reasons and stuff like that. But 2015, it's a new year. I'm going to be worrying about uh, myself, how I can continue to make all you all better people, just like I, you know, just try to make everyone in the house a better person, just like they make myself a better person each and every single day. So I hope you all come out and watch the stream on December 29th. It will be streamed at optic.tv forward slash flamesword. I hope you guys support the cause just like I am doing. It was, you know, put a lot of effort and patience into growing this. And I, I can't think of any better way than to do it for this charity. So, hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like, comment, subscribe. Please come out to the stream date when I am streaming it. And uh, just come fun. Try to get some giveaways. Donate. Help the kids out. And uh, let's make this as big as possible. So, thank you so much. And as always, this is the Out The Beer Friends. I'll see you guys later. Peace. I already know what this guy's answer is going to be. But are you part of the team Shave The Beard or Save The Beard? I think you should keep the beard, man. You look great with it. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah? Dude, I cannot wait till you shave that thing off. It literally disgusts me every time I see it. You are such a, you're, you're waste, like, the ugly people in the world, such as myself, are very envious of people like you who have chiseled chins, dashingly good looks, and that's something I wish I could have. And guess what? You're wasting your potential with that beard. It's like God gave you, well, something gave you this, these amazing looks. You, you look beautiful. But you're, you're just hiding it behind the beard. It's so like, why would you do that? So if this gets shaven and, and I do come out looking as handsome as you, you think I'm going to come out, are you going to treat me differently? Uh, yeah, I, I mean, I will. I, I'm going to be super nice to you because hopefully you can hook me up with some ladies. You know what I'm saying? Like, when we go, if we go out to an event and we go to the bars, it's like, all right, Mike, I need you to act really stupid and just use your looks to get the girls over here. But when they finally get into some deep conversation, they're thinking... Wow, this ugly guy is is really fun to talk to, but this other guy who I thought was cool because he's hot, he's not fun to talk to. I want to hang out with the ugly dude. Hey, I got you. I got you. Thanks, I got man. You. I, I appreciate that. We got a game plan, and let's stick with it.